The following video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer's discretion is advised. Hey, my you, you know where you watch? Dance Alright, my people, dance as killer day again. Big up and respect to each and everyone. Man, as you see. My people, I want to say this to each and everyone. Be careful how you do transactions in the public. Yeah. If you know, say, you're going to meet someone to buy something from someone or you're going to sell someone something, make the person meet you at a police station. See? You're more safer that way. You understand? Now, my people, I want to tell you about uh, an incident where it is said that a female got robbed by two men. And this incident happened on a no movement day within the country of Jamaica. Yes, on a no movement day within the country of Jamaica, like a 24 hour curfew time in the country of Jamaica. That's when the incident happened. Now, this incident where it is said that the female got robbed by two men happened on the 7th of September of the year 2021, somewhere within a place that is known as Portmore, that is within the parish of St. Catherine, that is within the country that is known as Jamaica. Now, all of these things what I'm going to say to you in this video are according to some things that I read in news articles and according to information that I got. You see me? Everything that I'm going to tell you in this video and everything that I've been telling you are according to things that I read in news articles and information that I got about uh, the whole situation because uh, more than one thing happened because of uh, the robbery that happened to the female. Now, let me explain certain things now. See? Listen. Now, what started out as a transaction over a cell phone evolved into a robbery and motor vehicles got damaged on the no movement day, which is the 7th of September, the year 2021. Two men who were traveling in a gray Toyota Probox motor car that was operating as a taxi somehow robbed a female now informations as to how they robbed the female are not really clear you see me i'm not sure if it's one person grabbed the phone or if a two of them grabbed the phone but it is said that they robbed the female meaning that they grabbed the phone from the female however according to the news article it is said that both of those men went into the gray toyota probox motor vehicle it is said that that motor vehicle, operated by one of the robbers, drove off leaving the scene of where the female had been robbed. And it is said that another motorist saw what was happening and chased those men who were traveling in that gray Toyota Pro Box motor vehicle that was operating as a taxi. See? Now, information are somewhat sketchy in the viewers and subscribers, but according to some more things that i read in news articles and according to information that i got it is said that uh, a toyota axio crashed and the back of the gray toyota pro box that uh, those robbers was traveling in got damaged as a result of uh, the chase that happened you understand all right now here is the part where real and truly have me thinking now because in a news article it is said that those two men who were traveling in the great toyota pro box got out of the great toyota pro box and got picked up by a toyota mark x that was being driven by someone else see so put one and two together viewers and subscribers it would seem as if all those persons were working together so it is said that that's how those robbers made their escape. You see? And then sometime after that, police arrived at the scene where those motor vehicles got damaged and do what they're supposed to do and so on. You see? And I got uh, information that uh, the driver for the Toyota Axio had been taken to a nearby medical center something like that because the, the the driver for the toyota axio got injured and um i didn't get any confirmed information about what happened to the female who got robbed you see me yes yeah, some of the informations are somewhat sketchy viewers and subscribers but me just give you the informations 
as how I get those informations, or should I say, as how I read them in news articles and how I get those informations. You see me I say, but my people, all of this is said to have happened on a no movement day within the country of Jamaica. I want to say to each and everyone, be careful because you may never know. You see me I say, anyways, I can't let me know what you think about this whole situation. Big up and respect each and everyone. And until next time, I'm in the dancer, Killer. No big up. Big up.